After training in China in the spring, I'm going back. It's time to Shaolin to compete in an international tournament with a team from Canada. We're definitely back in Canada, this Canadian flag. And this guy is a license plate. That's an abbreviation, it means lives for hockey. It's 6.30 in the morning and I'm back in Canada and I'm getting kind of into my uh, regular training routine. I got in late on a Tuesday, it's Friday morning now, and I took a couple of days off to sort of rest and recuperate after a long month of hard training and long journey. Uh, but now I'm, I'm getting into my kind of regular routine which is uh, getting up early and going to the local gym and I use their kind of aerobics room to do Kung Fu training when there's no classes in there uh, so it's, it's a little cold now it's about 11 degrees Celsius and uh, kind of rainy uh, though it is, is warmer than the winter for sure but, uh, but definitely this is not training in the blazing sun like in Wudong, that's for sure. I'm not going to have those kind of days, I think, for quite a few more weeks again now. So my, uh, my tan will fade and I'll be able to train with a lot less uh, sweating. So we'll th see how things go. Uh, I've got uh, nine weapons strapped to my back and I usually train uh, some few basic things, stretches, warm up, and some of my weapons forms that I learned from Pan Ching Fu. And, uh, but now I'm armed with uh, some extra things that I learned in Wudong. So I do those. And then I usually round off my training uh, by uh, brushing up on some of the new stuff I'm learning at the, uh, the Shaolin Temple School here in Toronto. So uh, I think I'll probably have to take a little extra time training in the mornings to kind of fit everything in, but uh, I'm going to see if I can squeeze in some Qigong, the Wudong Qigong, and maybe the Shaolin Qigong as well, and then my uh, weapons training, and then Wudong training, and then more Shaolin training. We'll see if we can get everything done. Canadian training session done. So that was uh, three hours down and I was able to hit pretty much everything I wanted to. Uh, some basic uh, Jibengong type uh, basic training, uh, stretching, some of my old uh, weapons forms that I'm used to doing, the new Wudong forms I've learned, my Shaolin temple forms, um, yeah, it was, it was really nice actually. I even got some uh, Qigong done in the beginning. And uh, it's funny, it's uh, 
It's a real foggy, kind of misty day. I feel almost like I'm back on Wudang Mountain. Not quite. So, I'll try to do a little bit of training tomorrow morning and actually tomorrow afternoon I have to take a uh, grading exam at the Shaolin Temple uh, to see what level I'm going to be at for the, uh, for the tournament. So maybe I might do a little bit of a uh, little bit of filming there and make a little bit of a, an episode out of that. So I'm going to go home now, get cleaned up and I have to work for the rest of the day. Oh,